this other one all straight? Yeah. Okay. Super Troy 4XS. Okay, it's 12 o'clock. So it's 12 o'clock, middle of the day, nice and hot. Should be about 100 degrees today. So we should get some nice thermic activity. All right, come on back. We're up. There you go. Brakes. Nice. There you go. Little left brake and turn and go. Turn and go. Little brakes, 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 brakes. There you go. Little brake. Left, 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 right. Left, left, left. There you go. Left, left, full throttle. Left brake. Beautiful job. A plus perfect. Super Troy. Do, do, do.
the throttle, ease off the throttle, go to idle. Okay, so you're going to want to land the same way I did, basically. Be careful because it's really turbulent, so be careful close to the ground. There you go, throttle, throttle, throttle. There you go. And now, there you go, little right, little right, throttle, little right, right, brakes, 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 brakes. Oh, <laughs> nice job, Troy. You almost got it. Good job, Super Joy! Doo -doo -doo. Wow, you burned it in good, but the uh, you went in the ditch. Hold on, I'll help you up. Hold on two secs. That was awesome! You just totally thermaled Mount Timpanogos. All right, the uh, that was an A plus perfect landing. Look at your perfect foot drag. You did an absolutely perfect foot drag slide. You just kind of misjudged how far you were going to slide. All right. Super Troy, was that the coolest thing you've ever done? Yeah. That was incredible. <laughs> Super Troy with the perfect landing. And the house hundred. Man, that was awesome though. You like did a perfect foot drag to landing and then you just misjudged a little bit and you ended up in the ditch. But you would you had that perfect, that was beautiful landing. Hey, I perfectly aimed and hit the ditch. Yeah, that was that was good. Alright, here we go. Careful, careful. Yeah. There we go. And good deal. Go for it. Back it on up. Beautiful. That was awesome. Yeah. High five. Super Troy, world's youngest paramotor mountain thermaling pilot. You just barely turned 13. Yeah, and that's my first time going thermaling. That was wicked. Did it uh, make you nervous at all? A little. The bouncing was kind of fun. That's hey. fun though, though, catching those thermals, huh? Yeah. Yeah. The, uh, it's like one o'clock. So it's midday, it's got to be uh, 103 today, so super high temperatures in the middle of the day in the mountains. So what would you say to all the pansy instructors out there who pretend you can only fly mornings and evenings? I proved you wrong. <laughs> Hello? There's literally guys that are telling people Oh, you can only fly early mornings and maybe in the evening. They're like so scared of bumps. And you're there tearing it up with a mountain thermal and 100 degree temperatures. It's because their glider can't handle what the Dominator can. Yep, that is a huge chunk of it. And the safety and the weight shift of the flat top is incredible. That's too cool. Oh, check this out. Got That's blood. so funky. The light keeps coming undone. Comes undone. So, 13 year old Super Troy shows how it's done. So, Super Troy, 13 years old.
How come it's so easy for you? Because I had super training. <laughs> Hello. Did you get the best training in the world or what? Yeah. Have you ever seen any other 13-year-olds foot launch a paramotor in 100 degree temps in the middle of the day and fly over a mountain? Nope. Never. I'm also Jordan. Huh? <laughs> The, uh, yeah, except your brother. <laughs> and Super Trevor. The, uh, well, he didn't fly until he was like. I don't know if Super Trevor's ever soared the mountain at age 13, though. Yeah. Jordan probably did. Yeah. But you're the, yeah, the holy cow. You just barely turned 13, though. Mm hmm. The, uh, wow. Thermalin in the middle of the day. No problem if you got super skills and you get the right gear. It's the coolest thing you will ever do.